time you learned that money is might. Here we go, boss fight. Oh my god, this guy is huge. Hello, Xavier here, and welcome back to another episode of Octopath Traveler, and today, here we are again. Now, last episode, I was under level to the point where I couldn't do Chapter 2 for Tressa, but today, I am in level 23. Now, uh, before uh, I finished grinding, I was in level 20 with Tressa, well, 21, and my last encounter was one of those uh, cats with bags on it I killed it and then everybody all of a sudden levels up like two to three levels I'm like what the heck so that if we see that cat again I'm definitely gonna kill it again that's a lot of experience it gave me I think it gave me like a thousand experience that was pretty cool but today we're gonna head over and Oh yeah, so let me show you some of the new stuff they have. So I think I showed this last time, but when the user is near death, is not near death, all attacks are would reduce the HP below zero. Will instead leave the user with one HP. Then we have some more skills for Cyrus. We have percipient, God, percipients prevents the party from being surprised by foes, which is really helpful. Then we have evil ward increases the party's success rate when attempting to flee, which is good it, it, sometimes gives the equipping character a 50% chance of attacking twice when performing a standard attack so this is going to be really helpful for honey I also gave them some better equipment um, I do want to go back to Ophelia's town and see if there's better stabs I can get so I'll probably do that um, offhand maybe after this episode but we'll see or whenever we get to a different town um, hopefully the next Quarry Crest Town has some good um, things, so we're just gonna run straight to Quarry Crest and start Tressa's um, quest, and that'll be really cool. Chapter two, and then, yeah, uh, let's see what happens. I believe she's following a journal, <coughs> so. No oh, okay. I do need a new. I need. I needed one of those new guys right here. Let me see. Uh, da -da -da -da. So he's gonna attack. So let's go with. He's gonna attack it anyways. What I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go and hit this guy right here. There you go. I've been playing this game a while. Uh, since last time I uploaded, I've been pay playing it every single day for, like, I think it was two days. So the day I posted it, I played and yesterday I played and um, yeah, today I'm just uh, barely getting into it. I it didn't. It took a while to grind actually. Um, it, it really took a while to grind. I'm trying to see if I got hit. Did I not get hit? Yeah, I guess I didn't. Okay, well then, um, I am gonna let's see. Oh shoot, this is so tough because like. I'm trying not to get hit. You know what? I'm just gonna flee. I'm I'm just gonna I'm just gonna run away because I'm trying to get to the chapter two. So there's different spots I decided to train at, and I couldn't find a really suitable place to train at because all of them were like level eleven. So as you can see, I went everywhere to train. So I went. So as you can see here, I went everywhere to train, and then one of the places I went to train was, uh, where is it at? Like, it's right here, before heading into the quarry crest, and that's because they have level 17. And then I decided to get all the way down here to this beautiful cave right here, the Twin Falls or something? The, uh, the cave right here. It was level 20, and that's where I trained. I got to level 20, and then I went all the way back here. 
to Boulder Fall, and that's before entering this town. And I mean, before entering, I encountered the cat, and that's when my level shot up more than I expected. But hey, that was pretty cool. So yeah, this is where I was pretty much training South Quarter Crest Pass. And then I went to some areas, got some chests, so this area is pretty much cleared out of chests, except that purple one which I can't get. But here we are, Quarter Crest. I've been waiting for this moment here. Let's see, uh, whose quest am I gonna do? Oh, okay, here we go. That's right, I had business here. Sometimes two chapters may commence in the same town. You can start, you can choose which whose stories you see first. Okay, so I want to see Tressa's story first, and then we'll move on to Cyrus. Enter a town without continuing the story, you can pick up the story at a later time by the, Oh wow, that's cool. Okay, well I'm gonna do Tressa's right now. Here we go. The story so far, spurred on by a curious notebook she acquired, Tressa set forth on a journey. Now she follows into the footsteps of the anonymous author in hopes of seeing the world and all the treasure it holds. Now, where did that leave off? Every journey is vast. Sea of opportunities, but none are quite as precious as our encounters with others. Sharing a connection with someone new for however brief a time is unforgettable. For it is a chance to learn about others and yourself. I'll rest here tonight in Quarry Crest. It's a sleepy little mining town for now. At least rumor has it there is gold in these hills, and many of our prospectors have set their eyes on it. I wonder what encounters might await me here. This must be Quarry Crest. Alright. Okay, she's looking around. Could there really be gold here? Eureka! Oh. Gold! I've struck gold! Now this is something to write home about. Huh? Where there's one, there's more. I'll find them all. <laughs> now if I find them first... No way. I guess there really is gold in these tar hills. Something tells me this may be a good place to set up a shop. Say your hands. It's Mr. Morlock. Good to see you. I'll toiling some earnestly. Mm. Who's this Mr. Morlock? Look, sir, real gold. How how much you reckon it's worth? Mm. Let me see that beautiful nugget. Hmm. It'd be happy to take it off your hands for a reasonable sum. I'll say it once more, so listen well. This mine and all the land surrounding it is the sole property of esteemed Mr. Morlock. As such, any and all gold discovered here in his is his by rights but fortunately for you mr marlock is a generous man he'll buy the gold off anyone who finds it so keep digging and you may find yourself with riches beyond measure <laughs> I see. looks like this morlock fellow has an iron grip on this mine i guess that means i won't be dealing in gold here but still, 
My merchant sensors tell me this town pre pre ugh, God. presents a lucrative business opportunity. Oh, I saw a character over there. <laughs> Alright, so. We're gonna head up there. Ooh, a chest! I found the chest! Yes! Yes. Chris to travel banter. This smells like trade, I say. Mm hmm. And what sort of smell would that be? Hmm, how can I put it? The smell of wares flying off the shelves of coins earned fair and square. Thou speakest of profit. Well, yes, I'm a manner. It's in a manner of speaking. But trade is more than that. It's about adventure, stories waiting to be told, a nobler calling than, than the pursuit of base co coin. Exactly. If thou speakest the truth, I shall join you in sniffing out this trade. Two noses are better than one. <laughs> that's actually pretty cool, huh? That's that's actually a really cool little gimmick they have here. <laughs> that's really cool. All right, so let's head up over here to. Ooh, let me see what kind of um, weapons they have here. Might be very helpful to level up my characters. Heavy lands. Ooh, man, they cost a lot of money. Flail. Yes, I get two new weapons. Yes, I get two two of those. Yes, I'm gonna equip them immediately. There we go. I get this one, which does more. Well, there's a elemental attack. Occasionally decreases the tar or target's elemental attack. This one seems better, but I don't have that much money. Um, so, Magus. Okay, so this increases the critical and the elemental attack. But this is so much better right here. Oh, I don't have enough for that. Hmm. I'm gonna sell my old ones though. There we go. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Alright, so I got some new weapons for my magicians. This is good. That's good. Alright, so we're gonna head up here, and here we're gonna have our quest. I dig and dig and dig and still can't find any gold. Curse my bad luck. I thought this would be my chance to turn it all around. I was such a fool, even I borrowed money to get this far. How can I ever face my wife again? What's that? Excuse me, sir. I'll buy these stones from you. You will? I will? Precious. Nondescript stone. A dull black stone. It gives off a bright shine when polished properly. Cool. I got a discount for 99. Hey, you have, have use of my goods? Bless you. Always looking for a bargain. I can't sell these to you, to you in good coincidence, miss. They're just lousy rocks. <laughs> yeah, but I insist. I'm a merchant, and I feel like these are more than the the. Oh god! I feel like there's more to these than meets the eye. There you go. I have to say that slowly. Thanks. In that case, they're all yours. Thank you kindly. All right, that was a that was really nice, Tressa. All right. Wow. Aha! I knew it. Underneath the grimy exterior was a gorgeous gem, just waiting to be discovered. Well, well. You're quite the eye, young lady. Huh? Pardon? Whoop. Hey, those are the same stones I bought. <laughs> right you are, I'm a traveling merchant. Ali's the name. I'm Tressa. Tressa, I'm a traveling merchant too. I've never seen stones that glow quite like these. 
They look just like ordinary rocks at first, but I'll take more than that. To, it'll take more than that to fool me. <laughs> you have no idea what you bought, do you? Uh... Should I? Indeed. These are sky stones. They're rare, but you can find them if you know where to look. At first, they're perfectly unremarkable rocks, but apply some quality elbow grease. And you have yourself a gorgeous gemstone. No way. I had no idea. <laughs> and still so you bought all those stones? Heck of a green pea you are. What? Green pea? See you around. Well keep up the good work. See you around, green pea. I feel like chapter 2 is going to have to revolve around that lady over there, Allie. Hmm, Green Pea. She's just a mean pea. But I don't have time for that now. I have stones that need selling. <laughs> Step right up. Come on, come on. Be the first to get your hands on one of the rarest treasures in the realm. Oh. <laughs> nope, it's better than gold. Now feast your eyes on this the shimmering sky stone. Oh my. Look how it sparkles. Oh. Let me see. Well, quite the beauty, isn't it? Why, I... I've never seen anything like it. It's absolutely breathtaking. Yes. See? But did you know the sky stone's radiance is surpassed only by its rarity? So if you'd like one of your own, this might be your only chance. I see. I'll take one. Splendid. Oh, me too. <laughs> wow, she sold that. <laughs> yeah. This place really is good for me. It's time to suck up the shop. Okay, cool. <laughs> I obtained 1,500. Wow. So I gained a thousand from just. Oh, let me see what the, the barter banter. A Skystone, eh? A significant discovery to be sure. Do you know much about Skystones, Professor Albright? I dare say I've read a book or two about them. I can say they are a type of ore, but I failed to recognize the stone for what it was, even when put before me. But your eyes saw true. Perhaps it is your merchant's instinct at work. Maybe, honestly, I wasn't certain those rocks were so valuable, but it but in trade, good opportunities don't come by every day. So you just have to roll the dice when you see one. In oh, damn it. I must confess, I was quite impressed at the way you managed to sell all those stones. Seeing the potential for trade in every part of life, you are a true merchant's merchant. Oh, God. It is a clever game you play, Tressa. I hope to see more of it. It's a deal, Professor. Alright, I love these little talks they have. It just adds really. It just adds to it. Oh, what the heck did I just find? Did I say, did I say ore? Knowledge. Oh, okay. Um. Did I say ore? I, I could have sworn I saw uh, ore or gold or something like that. Rare stone fishes is very price if sold. Dubious gold ore fetches a modest price and odds and ends fetches a modest price between the okay so okay so those are like condiments I guess so I want to head over here but first I'd like to save my game oh by the way the the Ulberic, that's one of my friends he's playing the Ulberic, so <laughs> okay now oh look at that stone it looks purple it looks interesting. So it looks like I'll be going to the Quarry Crest Mines next.
Okay. Whoa, there's a ton of these. I guess I have to go buy some more, huh? Yeah, looks like I need to buy more. Okay, so. A doll gives off a bright, so I'm gonna get those, yep. And then, oh, Shadow Soulstorm. A mysterious adventure is modest price of soul. And I'm gonna get that too, because, like, you want it? Take whatever you want. Always looking for a bargain. I didn't save, uh, I didn't, I didn't get a discount on that. But I'll get a discount hopefully again. What's this guy over here? Let me see. Hello, sir. I'll purchase some, uh, stones from you. There you go. Ooh, some light stone and some fire stones. Yes. Want to buy it? Help yourself. Always up for a bargain. All right. And I don't know what you want, but ooh, a chest. Yes, I I want it. Pool's gold ore. Okay. And I am gonna purchase some more stuff from you. Some more stones. Fool's gold ore and rare stone. For, uh, are you the one buying all the stones? Where do you want them? Always looking for a bargain. I should do it. Now it's back to the square. <laughs> Make for the bazaar. Okay, that was a lot of money. <laughs> to the bazaar. <clears throat> I have a feeling that guy's gonna show up now. And he's gonna wanna buy that stuff. Whoa. Okay, um. Here we go. I have a feeling he's gonna show up this time. Oh, this step right up. Ladies and gentlemen, gather round and prepare yourselves for a breathtaking sight. This, my friends, is the one and only Spark Shiny Sky Stone. <laughs> oh no. The proud owner of these lovely gems for just a fraction of her prices. What? <laughs> what a dirty trick. Setting up shop right next to me. I won't go down without a fight. They certainly are beautiful. But what makes your stones different from hers? You won't find purer sky stones anywhere. Just look at them. You can see all the way through. Not a single blemish or impurity to be found. Dazzling, is it not, milady? Almost as dazzling as your eyes. Well, when you put it that way. Oh, well played! <laughs> Sir, that doll's a boulder fall make, you know? A precious gift for a precious little girl, no doubt. <laughs> wow, he, he uses a lot of word, wordplay here. Indeed it is. Ah, clearly you're the type of father who wants only the best for his darling child. <laughs> oh, gosh. believe that doll will suffice the sky stone is as pure innocent and beautiful as a daughter's love <laughs> so much wordplay and every time she sees its radiant glow she'll remember her dear father who gave it to her oh wow <laughs> its light will connect her to you no matter how far you may travel well where do you roam? Dear father, when will you come home? <laughs> Surely you can see why this would be the best purchase you'll ever make. I can just see her smiling face now. What a pleasant young man. Yeah, I'll take one. You're most welcome, my good sir. Um, what? Step right up, there's not a moment to spare if you want a rare sky stone to call your own. You won't find them anywhere else, I promise. You won't be disappointed. I'll 
take one, please. One for me, too. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Would you look at that? Business is booming. Well, maybe not for all of us. You win this round. There's no way I'd lose to a green pea like you. I'll admit. Never seen anyone make a sale like that before. Practice makes perfect. If you want to survive in this world, you need to learn how to tug heartstrings and loosen purse strings. <laughs> Ooh, that's a good one. <laughs> but being a merchant is about more than just making a sale. A good merchant should understand what their customer needs and sell them what's best. What I sell may not be what they need, but it is what they want. What's wrong with a little embellishment? Embellishment? A merchant's words are like a warrior's blade. Don't forget it, Green Pea. Like around town. Okay, so we're gonna go down here. Oh wait, there's some more stuff. From Ophelia. This alley fellow seems rather good at this. Grr, I can't believe he got away with that. I must confess, I've never met anyone so smooth of tongue. In a way, it's hard to not to admire. Ophelia, whose side are you on anyways? But why, yours of course? This isn't over. I saw I'll make more coin than him before we're through. Just so, and I shall offer a blessing for your success. Do you think I need to practice my sales pitch? You mean to be more persuasive like Ali? No, not like him exactly, but if I did practice, maybe I'd be better at selling things. Eh, well, I suppose it could have just been practice that makes him sound so clever. Exactly, so all I need to do is practice more. In fact, I'll start now. You pretend to be a customer, alright? Wait, wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so here you go. <laughs> okay, let's see what's going on now. So hungry. But after that miserable show, I need to save my money. Hello there. Your finest meatball, sir. Well, if it isn't the green pea, you're looking famished. Yeah, I'll take... I'll take it you're on a tight budget. <laughs> Keep it. I refuse to take the pity of food from a rival. See yourself. So why'd you take up this line of work anyways? You see... Both of my parents are merchants, so I guess it just came naturally. And now I'm wandering the world and learning the trade as I go. Well, well. You don't say, my old man's a merchant too. In the south, everyone and their uncles heard of Maruf. The, oh God! In the south, everyone and their uncles heard of Maruf, the merchant. He was such a smooth talker, he could sell sand in the desert, but he never told, once told a lie. With just a few words, my dad could get anyone to buy what he was selling and make them feel genuinely happy about the purchase. It was like magic. His words had an incredible power, one that could help people see the beauty in things they purchased. And so I decided to follow in my old man's footsteps. Really? Did you take up the family business? Oh. No. 
No, I ran away from home. Ooh. I'll spare you the details. That's just how things played out. I see. It wasn't so different for me, you know. <laughs> hey, you don't say. Now then. Well, I've got another busy day ahead of me. Better luck tomorrow, eh? Yeah. Same to you, I made the best merchant win. I feel like that guy ha is going to have... There you go, I had a feeling. Hmm. Well, well, you seem to be doing well for yourself. Legal through your business may be... Illegal though your business may be. Hmm. And who are you? Hmm. Watch your tone, boy. Mr. Morlock owns this establishment as well as everything else in this town. <coughs> Ahem, that I must... I most certainly do. Hey, no. uh, that's great and all, but what do we do? You mean illegal? You may own all the gold, but these were just dusty old rocks until I polished them to to a sheen. That's pompous attitude will get you in trouble someday, boy. As a landowner here, Mr. Morlock has the right to oversee any and all business transactions he is so desires. As of now, that includes the training of your little rocks. Hmm. Does it now? That seems awfully arbitrary if you ask me. But that wouldn't be the first foul thing to happen here. Or weren't you aware, Mr. Morlock? You see, the price of gold actually. is actually ten times what you're giving to your miners. Maybe this isn't the time. Uh, it's exactly the time. They're deceiving honest, hard-working people just to line their pockets. On my enter is a merchant. I won't stand for it. Uh, Omar, teach this little desert ant what happens to pests who try to stain my good name. Ready to be squished, boy? I'd like to see you try. I'm stronger than I look. I'm well versed in all mar martial arts. Ali, the one man army, they call me in the south. The mere mention of my name strikes fear into the hearts of any who was wrong the common man. I've killed more people than I can count and all with one hand. Then you'll make a fine opponent. Oh. Oh, I had a feeling I was going to lose. The one-man army? Ah, a merchant's weapon is his words. We don't stand a chance in real battlefields. My fight was lost the instant we came to blows. I trust you've learned your lesson, Ant. Hmm, looks like your wares aren't selling so well. Don't worry, I'll take them off your hands. These stones belong to me, do you understand? If you're so determined to have them though, I'll let you be my little worker ants. Oh my god. I'll be I'll be in my manor. Come find me if you want a real job. Wow. <laughs> I can't believe that man. How dare he take advantage of people to line his own pockets? That's just dirty. I might not agree with everything he does, but I do agree with what he said to Mor Morlock. Time to, to uh. yeah! <laughs> it's time to kick some scoundrels, but even if he could have been more diplomatic about it. I have to save him. Morlock said he'll be in his manor. It's time to pay him a visit. Alright, here we go. Oh man, uh, you, I lost $500 too. Wow, that's, that's just... That sucks. Okay, well, we're gonna head over here. 
Marlock's Mansion. Mans. Oh, okay, Mans. Ah, Road to Marlock's Mans. Okay, um, there's some stones over here by the looks of it. Can I take any of these? Nope! Alright, ooh, I can save here. That's gonna be great because that was a long little chapter right there. <laughs> Alright. Save successful. Yeah, alright. So, let me get that chest down here though. I want every single chest I can find. There you go. Uh, I believe it's this way, huh? Yeah, it looks like it's that way. But I want to go to the left. Oh, man, these things. Okay, um, I guess I can quickly take them down. Let's go with uh, Firestorm. So let's do that. Alright. That's right, it is your turn. And you're going to use Trade Tempest. There you go. Uh, I'm gonna defend. And now, I'm going to go and actually, I'm gonna go to Beast Floor, Summon Beast. Okay, that's cool though. Alright, so I'm gonna defend again. Just because I don't want to attack and use my SP. Um, Linde, you are gonna do. You're gonna attack this one. There you go. You're gonna also attack. There you go. Cool. Get you out of the way. You're gonna defend. I don't wanna use your SP. Again, you're gonna defend. I don't wanna use your SP. Same thing's gonna go with you. I need. It's gonna use this attack right here. Oh, look at that! Second serving. All right, it works out at the end. We're gonna go and completely annihilate you, and I'm gonna have you attack. Ooh, look at that attack damage! Good job, Ophelia. Doing great. All right, look at that. So if, to get the new next and. Next skill, they have to get 3,000 JP, and as you can see, that's going to take a while, so. <laughs> Alright, so let's head up here. Can I not go over here? No, okay. Okay, I can't. I guess we can just head down this way. No, wait, what's that? Ah! Okay, this way. Wait, no, 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 no. I can head up here, right? Okay, I know, I knew I, knew I saw some stuff over here. Is there any chests over here? Yes. Healing Grape, alright. Oh no, this armor guy, oh man. This guy takes so long to kill, it's not even a choke. Alright, so, break on them shields. Please don't attack. Oh man, I, I always try to get by to see if I can beat the enemies without having to take damage so I can get extra stuff. Okay, so I got to care of those guys. Um, I'm gonna defend. Because I know I won't be able to do anything. And I'm gonna attack twice. There you go. Oh, look at that! Second serving again. Oh, that just saved me a bunch. Okay, so I'm just gonna have you attack with this regular attack. And then you're gonna be using Trade Tempest. Level 3! Like, this guy has a bunch of health. Alright, uh, Beast Laura, how much? 3% chance, but... Retaliate post Posture. What is that? Is that like a... I wonder what kind of attack that is, so like... Here are my beasts for now. I have the Ripper Bug, a Warrior Wasp. I, c I could use the Ripper bu Bug. This thing is actually pretty strong. Yeah, I'm gonna use that. Um... I'm gonna use your regular ch uh, attack here. Okay. Um, let's see. Now I'm gonna use trade wings again. Okay. I'm gonna have you. I'm just gonna have you attack regularly, just like and you too, Cyrus. That's right. You're you're gonna let it warrior wasp the uh, poison shot. Um, uh, no, I'm not gonna use that. 
And I'm not gonna use Lean Day either. I'm just gonna use this regular attack. Attack again. Nope. Okay. Attack again. There you go. <laughs> okay. There. That works out. Oh, look. Alright. That works out. Okay. I'm gonna have you attack with your cane again. You're gonna attack with your Traitor's Tempest. Trade Wings. There you go. Cyrus. You're just gonna do a regular triple attack. Cane attack. No? Oh my god, this guy is so strong. Okay, I'm just gonna use a stab attack. There you go. Cyrus doesn't have another thing, so... Oh, look at that! I thought it was gonna be Cyrus. Oh well, okay. Got it then. Honey's level 23 and Tressa level 24. This is great. This is awesome. Um, let's, let's move on towards the mansion of this guy who's clearly stole my money so what if I didn't have 500 G ooh that would have been interesting oh come on that would have been very interesting okay this is not gonna be that hard okay that's good um, oh shoot uh, I was hoping <laughs> uh, Tressa was in the front or at least Cyrus um, some beast throat attack please Oh, it's a pounce attack. No. I was hoping for a sweep attack. Now I can do my trade tempest. There you go. And it looks like um, I'm gonna choose regular attack. Actually, no, I'm gonna use my luminescence attack on these. Okay. There we go. Uh, so the body bash. And just oh my god, I hate these things. Okay, uh, I'm gonna do an attack like this. There you go. This should take down some of them. There you go. Okay, um, their health is pretty good. I'm not worried about their health right now. Um, but I am gonna attack you. I'm gonna attack you. There you go. I'm gonna try to take down as many as I can. So I'm gonna go with this attack. There you go, cool. And then you're gonna attack regularly. And then you're gonna attack regular attack as well. Another nice, nice. Okay, and all I need is this. Boom. Good. Now I can just directly attack you. Okay. There we go. Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay, cool. Cyrus is almost going to level up, which is really cool. Alright, so... I see a chest. Ooh! Oh, that is a lot of money. That's so great. That's going to fill my pockets up. Good, good, good. Alright, saved. Let's move on to his manor. Danger level 18. What? Is there really gonna be any, like, enemies in here? Oh no, there is gonna be enemies. Maybe a bunch of chests, right? I can, I can take stuff from it? Yes. <laughs> Healing grape. There we go. This reminds me, well... Okay, um, oh, dang it. Whoa, 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 what the heck are those enemies? <laughs> okay, um, I have no idea if any of you are affected by bows, but let's find out. Yes, you are, yes, ooh, yes, perfect. I'm pretty sure you're affected by this, yeah, there we go. And fire attack. And uh, let's do a little luminescence attack. Slash attack. You missed, boy. That's right. You missed. I'm going to do Aerosome again. That was a really good move. Okay. I'm gonna 
overkill you, Mr. Uh, guard guy. Fireball attack, please. There you go. Good job, Cyrus. Cyrus is going to level up, so that SP is going to go up again. Yes! I was hoping for that. <laughs> I don't like having... Um, like, his SP... Like, he has some really good attacks, but his SP goes down so... So much, and... Is there anything behind here? No? Okay. Um, and, and his SP just goes down so much, I'm going to save. Again, yes, I know, I'm sorry, I just saved not too long ago, but... Okay, um... I need to get every chest I can. Contiguous stone. Pretty sure this- Ah. Oh. oh, these guys again. Let's see what uh, your other weaknesses are. Okay, ice magic. Okay, that's pretty cool. Alright, um... Um... Definitely gonna use this on you. I'm next. I'm gonna use my ice wind attack. I'm gonna do regular. I just want to break his shield. And then with honey, I'm gonna use my. Oh, I can't use arrow storm. Okay, uh, I'm gonna use a uh, rain of arrows. Oh, so close! Oh my god! Oh man, that sucks. Um, I'm pretty sure you're the. Oh, what is your other one though? Like, because it's definitely not gonna be mad like the other. Okay, so I'm gonna use an item on them, and I I'm gonna hope. Do we have? Oh yes, I have a fire fire stone. Yes. There we go. Oh wow, that just that's completely domination right there. That's domination. There you go. Wow, the experience is actually pretty going up a little bit. More than I thought it would. Okay, so I got Wind Soul Stone. I know, I'm sorry, I probably used the Fire Stone. I just didn't want to get hit. Let's go up in here. Morlocks Mountains. Level 18. Okay. So many chests here. I need to get them all. I need to get every single chest in this mansion. God, this mansion is pretty big too. Oh, more enemies. Oh, these things I've seen before. Fire, right? I'm definitely affected by fire and light, right? No? Okay. Probably, probably thought it was something else. Um, I'm actually going to have... Then they do a sweep. Pounce? Oh, okay. Well, at least I know it has one thing. I'm gonna have you do this, okay? And I know for a fact they're affected by fire. That's a fact I know. No? Oh, uh, was it ice? Oh no, it was ice, wasn't it? Minde, please use it. Not pounce. I was hoping she could do um. Sweep. That way she can get the everything. Um, luminescence? Maybe. Okay, that should deal with... Okay, that's good. Took him out of the way. And I'm gonna attack you with this. There you go. So it is... It's gonna be ice. No? No, I swear to... I could have sworn that... They, these things were affected by... Oh... They're Thunder Sentinels, I thought they were the fire ones. They look so alike, dang it. So they're definitely affected by lightning then. I, it has to be it, right? Or is it wind? I have a feeling it's wind. I have a feeling, yeah, it should be wind then. Ooh, I can't open this chest. Dang it, how do I open those chests? Oh, I'm sorry, I'm being quiet. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna save here. There we go. I know, I, I'm saving a lot, but you know, I like to save. And you never know what's gonna happen. Chest! 
All of of life. Okay, here we go. Omar, Omar how fair my covers. Uh. Overflowing as always, sir. And I expect even greater profits with those stones. <laughs> as if I wasn't wealthy enough already to think these dirty rocks would prove more valuable than gold. Those rocks belong to us. Oh, perhaps Omar rattled your brains a bit too hard. Let me remind you that this land, all of it, belongs to me. So even if a little ant like you manages to dig up something beneath the surface, it's mine. You don't want to make an enemy out of me. I can crush bugs like you with the bottom of my shoe. Between the mines and the stones, my profit will continue to grow. It's only a matter of time before I'm the wealthiest man in the realm. <laughs> Hold it right there. Green pea? Come to inquire about a job, have you? Very well. I'd sooner eat those rocks than work for you. You're as much of a fool. The boy is then. To think two self styled merchants will be so averse to making money. You should know that I pay my loyal men quite well. Everyone has a price. I understood that more than ever. Chased out that stubborn old landlord and took me. You what? <laughs> There's nothing that money can't buy. So, what's you? On second thought, never mind. Your Maroof's. For all I know, you could be a fraud just like your old man. A... Uh, a fraud? Shut up! Didn't he tell you? His father's an infamous swindler in the South. He made a fortune scamming gullible sops with fanciful half-truths. Until, that is, he got swindled himself by a trusted friend of all people. Saddled with debt, poor Maroof ended up bankrupt. A sad tale, no? <sighs> Ali? There's no room. For emotion in business. The poor, stupid fool. Say that one more time. What's that? Insult my father's name one more time and I'll... My father was a good, honest man. He sold his customers what they wanted. And his words made them happy. Your father was nothing but a lousy lying dog. Those with money make the rules, boy. Second rate peddlers like you and your old man should shut up and die like the paupers you are. You son of a. If you won't work. I'll just find another way to make money off of you. You won't sell for much, but it's better than nothing. 
Mr. Morlock. Never in my life have I heard someone spout such cruel words. Your coffers may be overflowing, but you're still morally bankrupt. Oh, go on. You make a mockery out of others like you're getting paid for it. You cheat your workers out of their hard-earned money and monopolize their profits. If anyone's a swindler here, it's you! It seems you've forgotten your own manners. Omar, let's hope... That's right, let's take Omar down! It's time you learned that money is might! Here we go, boss fight! Oh my god, this guy is huge! What the heck? What next? Okay, so... I know that... Light... Definitely gonna be... Well, no axe. How about Lance? It's definitely gonna be one of them. Okay, so... How about... I do... Can't do Aerostorm. Let's do Rays of Arrows. Wow, that did nothing. Okay, well. Definitely gonna go with the blizzard right now. Uh, do I want to? Yes, I do. Let's go with the blizzard. Oh, cool. We're gonna get some ice. Like you guess, I guess. Um, definitely gonna try out for this attack. Yep, there you go. And, I'm gonna go with a luminous attack on everything. There you go. So I'm gonna take care of the goons first. The goons definitely gonna go first. So I'm gonna take care of foot the footmen. Let's take care of the footmen. Oh, but wait, wait. There's more. I'm just gonna go and oh, actually no. Oh yeah. Oh, I have such great idea. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna go to rest. Yeah, time for a break. Okay, and I'm gonna analyze you. Okay. My turn now. I'm gonna go with okay. heal more. Bring about a of heal. There we go. 330. Oh god. Omar's Titans, his- Oh, come on, you gotta be kidding me. Well, then. Bring about the miracle of That's right, okay, I can heal very easily. Ooh. Okay, well, um. I'm gonna rest up. Again. Time for a break. And then I'm gonna have you analyze him. Okay, okay, there we go. So I learned a bit more. Taking care of that foot soldier. That's gonna be my best bet right now. Let's take care of this other foot soldier as well. Well, actually, no, I'm gonna take care of this guy right here first. There we go. And let me analyze this guy. Again, wind magic. All right, that's actually pretty good. Let's uh, let's do that. Hmm. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my friend. Oh my. You're very, very um. <sighs> oh man. Ophelia, you need health, like. Badly, please don't attack her. Oh shoot! Okay, well I know for a fact is I'm gonna do what I wanted to do now, which is hired help, bandits. There we 
There you go. That's right. Okay, now. <laughs> I would love to analyze you, but I need to revive um, Ophelia. Cyrus is holding up pretty well. There you go. Item. Okay, so. You. You, you are a completely different story, my friend. God. Okay, I'm gonna give this to Hanis. There you go. And then I'm gonna have Ophelia revive everybody. Oh, no! No! <laughs> okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna heal. Oh, man. This I'm in such a bad position. Um... Uh, Olive of Life. Who's okay? Definitely Tressa can take hits. So there you go. And then I'm gonna have her heal Cyrus as well. Oh, he lost all his things. Oh, that sucks. Oh my God! You gotta be kidding me. Come on! Okay, and I need you to heal Philia. No. Mm. I need you to do Ophelia. There you go. Oh goodness. Okay, so now what I'm gonna do? Oh my God! Everybody is dying here. This sucks. Oh my god. Okay, so. Best thing I can do right now is that. I can't even attack twice. I'm gonna have to rest up. Oh no. This is such bad positioning for me. Um, all allies. I'm gonna have her heal up. Ophelia, please don't die on me. Oh my god, Ophelia. Tress is like the only one. <laughs> Are you kidding me? I am so. Oh, okay, I'm dead. <laughs> oh my god. That's my first game over. Okay, so this is why we save, guys. This is why we save. Let's get back into this battle. <laughs> oh my. That's right, I'm gonna get into the battle straight away. I know what they're affected by. So, first things first. Train Tempest, get them down. I'm gonna take the Goonies out first. I'm not gonna focus on Omar right now. For a fact, I'm gonna take this guy down first. There we go. Ice magic. There we go. And now I'm gonna go with um, Luminescence. Okay. I'm just gonna take care of these guys right now. So let's go with the Beast Lore. Uh, summon a beast. Let's go with um. Mm, there you go. That's right. I'm gonna go with um. Pirate help. I'm gonna go with the bandit. I'm really trying to take out at least one of those damn guys. <laughs> Omar comes next, so I'm just gonna. There you go. Okay, now, again, uh, let's go with the. Uh, do I want to go with this attack though? It's gonna use up a lot of my stuff. Um, I'm gonna go with Blizzard then. This guy's still not dead. Oh my god.
Great Tempest. I'm still trying to take that one guy out too, like what the heck. Okay, um... What the heck is your next attack? Like, what the heck? What is your next weak- what is your other weakness? Lightning? Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna use my cleric healing attack. Well, heal everybody. Oh my god. I'm still trying to take at least one of these goons out. Oh god, a vacuum slice, just killer! Look at that, Ophelia's already dead. <laughs> oh my god, trade Tempest please. I'm gonna use an item that heals everybody. Well, first things first though. Olive of Life, there you go. I'm gonna use my Lightning Bolt attack. And now Ophelia, heal more. No, actually, no. You're gonna you're gonna use an item that heals everybody. There we go. That's so much better. Okay, so let's go with uh, Hyrie's help. Okay, there we go. Can I get one of the guys out? No! Oh my god! What next? How are you still alive though? Like, how much health does this damn one foot soldier have? Like, this guy's still not dead. Max lightning attack. Thank you! My goodness! One down. Uh, let's go trade Tempest again. I got the other full surger out. I'm trying to take that all the full surgers out right now. I'm not even kidding. Come on. Oh my god. At least I can take a hit from Omar. Like, just one attack is good enough I can take, you know? Yes! Okay, now I can just focus on Omar. Oh, thank god. So I just have to worry about one enemy now, which is amazing. Okay, so I'm gonna use my heal more, max it out. Heal my team, make sure that I can survive an attack from this guy now. So now, I need to figure out what your attacks are again. You're not affected by that. Uh, that's summoning a beast. Um, you're not affected by a river bug. Um, I know you're affected by... Can you be affected by axes actually? Uh, uh, no, you can't. Spears definitely. Um, magic is something you are affected by. Uh, I'm going to use holy light on you. So let's do that. Okay, uh, javelins. You are affected by javelins. So let's. Well, these. There you go. These spears. Okay, cool. Uh, attack. Okay, you attack Trissa. It's fine. Um, I need to heal. Actually, what? I need to analyze your last thing. Daggers. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did I just see his health? <laughs> what the heck? Okay, anyways, uh, summon beast. I have no beasts that do daggers. Oh man, I had one, uh, but I used it up already. Um, let's see, what am I gonna do? Poison a shot. Let's try that. If there's a chance I can poison you, I'll take it. None of them are dead. That's good. That's good. None of them are dead. Um, oh man. Let's see. Heals good dark damage to all foes. Light magic to all foes. I'm gonna use the life stone. Try this on your side. One thousand, okay. Okay. Um. What do I want to do? Do I want to heal? Right. I definitely want to heal my team. Cannot analyze. Reveal the HP and one weakness of a single foe. You have a lot of HP. 
But if you attack, you're definitely gonna kill somebody. So I'm gonna heal Tressa. Okay, good. His money's worth. Okay, well I don't care about the one what money worth you are or not. So are you gonna get poisoned? Is my question. Um, definitely. He's gonna break at this point. Okay, so I'm gonna actually use my scholars to go analyze. Twenty-seven thousand. Oh my god. Okay, so twenty-seven thousand is his total health right now. I'm gonna so definitely gonna really restore the SP of a single one. You use the most SP here. I'm not gonna lie. Um, I'm gonna use my javelin to just destroy you. Wow, this barely does any damage. Did I poison you? No. Okay, so definitely my magic uses a lot of stuff. Um, but how much? Okay, I guess I can do that. Wait, how did how the almost Titans is? Oh my god, again with the thing. Wow, nine this time? Oh my god, this this guy keeps on increasing his. Okay. I'm gonna use Scholar Skill Blizzard. There's no point of upgrading it because. Can I poison? No? Okay, well, return to the wild. Uh, attack you. There you go. Uh, Blizzard. There you go. And then all I need to do is attack you with a single club. Boom. There you go. There you go. Alright. Um, Riverbug Mighty Slash. 500. Okay. <laughs> um, definitely gonna max out my ice attack this time. Oh, there you go. That's 3,000 down. Um, shoot. What is. What else can you hire? Like. Nice sword attack. Uh, dagger attack on every. And dancers. Let's do dancers. Alright, 1,000. Okay, that's decent. Um, Riverbug. 1,000. Oh, awesome. Okay, so he's gonna return this turn. So I'm just gonna do that. I'm gonna save up and stock up. He's gonna reinforce himself, right? No, he's not gonna do that. He has stress at one health, but that's because of her skill. Thank God. And Philly is dead. I just noticed that. Um, do I want to revive her? <laughs> this is a stupid question. Of course, I want to revive her. <laughs> But, oh man, okay, so do I want to heal? I'm definitely gonna have to revive her right now. Um, so, revive her. Have her as an extra, right? No, I can't use her. Okay, um. I'm gonna have you heal yourself. There we go. And then I'm gonna have you do pounce? Yes! Weak. Oh man, that attack though. Side sweep. Did anybody die? Osiris and Honey. Really? Okay, well. Oh my god, Ophelia. Come on. Really? You have no no SP? Let's go. <laughs> oh my god. All of the life. Do I want to bring... I want to bring Osiris back. Because he, he has his ice attack. Hmm... Damn, this is not easy at all. Let's uh, bring Honey back to life as well. Okay, Honey is next. Um, Cyrus, can you give him give him a plum? Give him a plum, please. Okay, there we go. That's right. Now, now I can attack your ass. Oh my god. Okay. I need to break the shield. Then I gotta go get this and da da da. Let's go with. Yeah, Blizzard has two hits, so. It's good like that. 
Call, call. No, my goodness. <laughs> oh my god. Why? I didn't have enough. Like I didn't have enough trouble dealing with just one enemy. <laughs> oh my god! I want to cry. <laughs> okay, you know what? I'm just gonna take care of you. Your your shield right now. Like I. Oh my god! You gotta be kidding me! Like seriously? These guys are back. Oh my god. Okay, so I can do that and then it'll increase my defense. So that's, that's the best thing I can do at this moment. Affiliate is gonna have to heal everybody up. Um, so I'm gonna give her an inspiring plum just so she can get that extra. There you go, and she's gonna have to heal everybody up with heal more. Please survive. Like, why are these guys back? I hate these guys so much. <laughs> Lightning bolt. Oh, and then freaking Omar comes back in the next turn. Oh man, this is this sucks. I must save it. There you go. Do a lightning attack. Oh my god, how many how much health do these guys have? Like attack. Okay, uh, Lilia, I need you to heal everybody again. Okay. I'm gonna focus on taking these dang guys out again. Okay, yeah, I'm definitely gonna want to take all these guys out again. I'm really trying to take these guys down again. I'm, I'm not even focused on Omar right now. It's just like... Oh, man. Yeah, your money's worth my ass. Oh my god, like, what the flip, man? I can't, I, of course I can't capture any of those. I'm gonna restore my health. What? <laughs> oh my god, okay, well, um... Let's go with, um... Hired help, and let's go with Mercenary. Six turn, boy. There we go. <laughs> uh, oh man, I need to like heal. Arguments one element elements for two. One oh, one allies element defense for one turn. But I'm not getting hit by any. Um, I'm gonna have to just do a small heal wound. Cyrus, can you take at least one down? No. <laughs> They're back! Dang it! And then Omar attacks next turn too. Dang! Okay, oh my goodness! <laughs> it's my last olive of life. Oh my god. Okay, so, Ophelia! Oh my God. <sighs> Let's try this. I'm like so concentrating right now.
I'm so trying to concentrate right now. Like. Yeah, boy! <laughs> I'm sorry, I got excited. <laughs> oh my god, okay, well, I, I'm gonna attack freaking Omar right now so I can take the, start taking shield down. Um. Can I take this guy out? Oh my god. God damn. Thank you. Damn, guys are out of the way now. Oh my god. <laughs> no, hold on, attacker. Dang it. Oh my god, no. Not all oh, for the love of god. I can't even take your shield down. <sighs> oh gosh, this is not funny. No, I was hoping he can just attack Hanese and that can use affiliate to revive everybody. Oh my god, no. I'm gonna have to use healing grape on there. Honey is the only character I have left now. My arrow fly and true. Okay, so I'm gonna have to use um, Ice Soul Stone on this guy. This. Are you kidding me? I'll be back. Alright, so I went back to grind a few levels and I got some new skills for them and I finally have their final equip support skill. So I have the SP saber which saves um what was it? Uh, it saves um uh, some you know halves basically the SP I use, Vim and Vigor heals me by the end of each turn. Saving Grace, I can heal over my HP and patience. I might have a had, ugh, I might have a chance to attack again, 25% chance at the end of each turn. So, yeah. So, I'll get back to you guys once I've actually gone into the part where I beat the boss. <laughs> Yes, I finally defeated Omar. <laughs> now I just gotta take down the goons. Ah oh, man, okay, so... Just gotta kill these two. That's it. <laughs> oh man. Let's see, I'm gonna use uh, hired help and then bandits. There we go. Okay, almost there. Almost there. You know what? I want to revive. I need so. Let's do that. And I'm gonna go find Plum on you. Oh, we're almost there, guys. Letting my arrow fly and true. Bunch of skills. Beast. And heal. What is the logical and then she's max lightning blast attack. There we go. We beat the boss. Finally. <laughs> I had to be a bit more tactical that time. Uh, Omar's axe. Oh, that's gonna be good for honey. Oh, that's so cool. No. <laughs> now, apologize to Ali for what you said about his father, hmm. Green P. 
Well, Mr. Morlock. I'm sorry. I'm so terribly, profusely sorry. <laughs> I take it all back. Every word. So... Good. I take it you'll be leaving this town never to return? Mm. We leave town, but I... So Being a good merchant is all about timing. You need to know when to cut your losses. Or having you heard of sunk costs. I foresee great misfortune in your future if you stay. Come on, right? Better opportunities await for us. Thanks for your axe, Omar. <laughs> Pretty sure it's going to be very helpful. Good riddance. Now to find someone honest to run this town. Tressa. Tressa. Woo! <sighs> God, that was a long battle. It took me 37 minutes to beat. Well, like 30 minutes, let's say that. As much as I hate to say this. I owe you one. And a merchant always pays his debts. You have my word. <laughs> I'll hold you to it. What Morlock said about my old man? It's true. Some did call him a swindler. But it was a lie spread by competitors who were jealous of his talent. And while it's true my father was deceived by his friend and forced to take on his debt, it doesn't diminish the things he taught me. Our words have the power to make our customers happy. So I'll follow in my father's footsteps. Work hard, and go back home with enough money to pay our debts in full. Ali! Say, have you ever heard of the Merchant's Fair? It's the greatest auction in the realm held each year in Grandport. The wealthiest and most influential people the world over come to feast their eyes on treasures beyond your imagination. They say there's nothing you can't buy at the Merchant's Fair. That sounds incredible. I'm going to go there and make my dreams come true. If you can make it at the fair, you can make it anywhere. You really do have a way with words, Ali. Guess I'll be seeing you in Grandport. I was hoping you'd say that. <laughs> well, we still need to have our rematch. And what better place to settle the score than the Merchant's Fair? <laughs> I'll bring my best treasure. If you think you stand a chance, I suggest you do the same. I'll find the greatest treasure there is. You'll see. Good. Once you have it, come find me at the fair. I'll be the one drawing the largest crowd. <laughs> they won't stick around for long after I get there. This guy's smooth. <laughs> You're sounding less green already, Green Pea. See you at the fair. Sharing a connection with someone new. For however brief a time, is unforgettable. After we met, all I wanted to do was forget Ali. He sure knows how to make a lasting impression. Now, I think I've found a good rival in him. Funny how things turn out, no? And now I know my final destination. Grand Port and the Merchant's Fair. For now, I'll follow in the footsteps of the Nameless Traveler and make for Victor's Hollow. There I'll find myself a treasure beyond my wildest dreams. Wow. 
chapter 2 of Tressa's story is finished. Oh my god. Look at her HP 67. <laughs> she was at the brink of just like collapsing. Oh my god. And then we still have Cyrus story too. Oh man, I have to I have to heal. Alright guys, thank you guys for watching today's episode of Octopath Travelers. It was a long, long day of playing for me. It took at least two hours just to complete chapter two just because I had to go back, grind again, and do all this stuff again. But thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next episode of Octopath Travelers. Bye!